What's going on, YouTube? Fight on five, two, video response. I don't even know if we can do video responses anymore. Hell, if I know, I don't know. But it's going to go up in my feed. Uh, wonderful topic. Uh, he's worried about this topic quite a bit, and I'm no, I'm, I really don't understand uh, why, because I, I'm a laid-back person, pretty much. There's, there's not, there's things that upset me. It's and it has nothing to do with none. I don't cards don't upset me at all. It's what I, it makes me smile. It's what I think about when I'm working. Uh, when I'm bored, uh, when I'm bored, I go through them. It, it's everything to do with cards of love. From top loading them to reading them to just looking at the beauty of them, I just I don't I I love every aspect of them. Now his conversation, his uh, um, is what we're talking about. Gifts, gifts is a gifts are a gift. Um, now if someone sends me something and I already have it, it happens. Lots. I'm thinking it happened lots. The way we collect, the way this, these certain people on YouTube collect, we have a lot of stuff. All of us do. And uh, it happens where someone sends me something I already have. Sometimes I don't know it already. I have to look through. Sometimes I know right away. But it's almost like the unwritten rule. I, you send me a dupe, I'm going to keep the one you sent me. And usually this, you send me a dupe is something I bought years or months or whatever ago um i'm gonna send them one i bought now if it comes to two collectors and send me if i can i'll keep both if not depending on what it is you know if it's something huge i'm gonna keep both if it's something small i'll send one or the other um but i know plenty of packer fans on here um that don't have that i'll find out if they have it or not and i move it on down the line it's like it's the unwritten rule you move it on the down the line if you already have it uh, it's usually just accepted that we do that. Now, if someone sends me something and I uh, all of a sudden I'm in dire straits and I lose my job, I I gotta sell my some of my stuff, and I'm gonna try to sell that stuff last. But I'd be letting everybody know I'm losing it here. Uh, I'm on nothing, but uh, thankfully it never happened to me. But I know it's happened to some people where they all of a sudden they're strapped for cash because something happened, and they, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. I say, say if I now now we're gonna switch it around. Say if I send you something, and all of a sudden you're strapped for cash. Yeah, do what you gotta do to survive. I am not gonna be worried about you saving my card. I really am not. Um, just do it. It's not a big deal. Now, if I send something like a dupe to somebody and you move it along to another person, like I said, not worried about it. I'm trying my best to to send you stuff and make you surprised. And I don't know what everything you have. I don't get into the photo buckets anymore as much because I don't like using photo bucket now because they change stuff. Um, so if it's like a dupe, Move it along if you can. I know, I know everyone knows other fans of other people on uh, the same teams on there. So if say if I send something to Smitty, he already has it and he moves it along. I am not gonna be worried about it at all, at all. Uh, it's a gift. You, you do what you do. Now he was talking. James was talking about instances where PCs change. Okay. This is this is the what I feel about that. Not a big deal. My PC is never going to change. I might add PCs or add sets that I'm doing, um, and if I move that set along, I'd have. If I make a set and I move it along, it's I I'm assuming that no one's going to care. I mean, I worked hard at my stamp set, um, just by the will that no no one could find any stuff to help me. Through that whole entire time, because these are t they were tough. They were only numbered to ten, but I did uh, save someone so um, sent me something like that. I probably would have just reciprocated and just like I would on anything, sent them something they would enjoy, and uh, they know that when I sold the set, it was part. It had to go with it because it's a set. 
So, but say if someone sends me green and gold, I don't care what it is. I'm going to love it, basically. Easy. Yeah, like I said, but now we're just talking about PCs changing. Say uh, I send you something for just a player PC. Uh, say you PC one certain person that's not in your realm of your team and your PCs change and you sell the something sell or trade something that I sent you to get a new PC or to add to your regular PC I'm not gonna care <laughs> basically in the long run I am helping out a PC in the long run you know or you know if you're switching up PCs which is fine do what you got to do it make if it's fun for you do it um I have some side little PCs that I look at uh, once in a while. Um, here's a great example. I had uh, two uh, Eli Manning autos of the same car, numbered to like 20 or something like that, and Tanvir needed it for his NT auto set or NT set of the Giants. I'm a semi very uh, at least at that point I was. I, I still love my Eli Manning cards. Um, and I, since I had two of them, I said, I'll send you one anyway. And he sent me back an Eli Manning exquisite auto. And I says, it's nice to look at, but you don't send me your PC stuff. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's um, my side PC has no weight <laughs> on your, on your main PC. So I sent it back to him eventually. And I just, it was nice to look at, though. Believe me, it was beautiful. Um, but uh, I'm not trying to call Tanvir out. It's not what it is. Um, I just could not in my heart. I love the card. It is absolutely beautiful. But it should not be in my Eli Manning PC when that's your main PC. I, I just couldn't. I just couldn't. It was just visited, I told him. It just visited for a little while. Because <laughs> it was fantastic. Um, but that's the way I feel. Um, don't. People shouldn't break up their main PCs. For anything, for anything, and that's and I just could not take that card. I I felt horrible. <laughs> I just couldn't. I loved looking at it though; it was beautiful. Um, um, so if you gotta, if I send you something, you gotta move it to because your ch PC's changed. No biggie. Not gonna care. You move it to your main. Basically, in the long run, I'm helping you do a different PC, which is fine. And that's all I really want to do is help your PC. So. That's all I think about that. Uh, it's a great conversation. I could talk on forever. I I already tried making a video here and it was like 16 minutes and I was <laughs> really rambling. So I'm going to cut it down. I cut it down this time around. But um, James, it's a great thing. Uh, great conversation. Uh, I wish I could have this conversation in person with you. It'd be, um, we can get into it. I believe me. Um, or with anybody. Uh, I have like four or five that I still have to watch that I, in my in my feed that I'm just absolutely excited to hear what people think. Um, but like to me, I'm too laid back in cards. It's my, it's my hobby. I I want my hobby to be easy and laid back and fun. <laughs> I don't want it to be stressful at all. I don't, at all. It's not, It's if it was stressful, I wouldn't do it. <laughs> I love it. I love it too much. I love every aspect of it too to to make it stressful i don't want to ever want to make it stressful so it's that's about as easy as i can put it so thanks everybody for watching deuces love you guys and i i am so excited for nationals and uh when i get my taxes back that's when i'm going to start making plans so probably end of february march i'm going to start booking stuff and i'm so excited to meet all you guys it's going to be fantastically fun i can't wait i just can't wait i don't think i've ever been excited like this excited since i was since i'm like a little kid going to uh going on to the on the roller coasters i'm just really pumped up <laughs> but thanks everybody for watching we'll go deuces one more time go pack go love you guys